All right, guys, welcome back to Rod Doing Stuff Outside. Today, we're inside our monster lodge. We're gonna build us a floor. Now, I saw somebody else on YouTube. It goes by D-U-B-B-Y-S uh, D-I-Y is his channel. And he made a floor using some landscapers fabric, so I'm not, this isn't my original idea. But he just showed folding it out and stuff. I'm gonna show how I put it together. So anyway, if you stick around, we're going to show you how we're going to make this floor for our monster lodge. Alright guys, so we've got this laid out. What we're going to do is we're going to figure out, they've got to be spaced far enough apart that they can fold. And then we're going to build another one and put it over here. So we're going to put take these smooth edges. I'll show you here. We're going to take these. And we'll glue these in. I already tried it on one of them and it worked really good. And then we'll put the landscaper fabric on the back. I need that glue there. So we've got this 77 Super 3M. This is what that guy said he used. And we're just gonna put a good coat on here. You may want to put on some gloves. I should have gloves on because. That other one I done, the stuff got all over my hands. And then we're just gonna coat this other side. And then it says to let it tack up. So we're gonna give that a few minutes while I spray these other ones down and then we'll put them back on. We just got this here landscape fabric we're gonna cut this into some probably three or four probably well probably five six inch strips and then glue it down the middle of those I see that I wonder if we could just cut through the whole thing you know what I mean so this is what I'm thinking is let's just cut just cut right here but all the way through could we get this on the... get the saws on yeah <laughs> I'm thinking that maybe that wide. Cut I've ever done. <laughs> well, yeah, but that's better than at first. I was thinking about rolling the whole thing out and cutting it into long strips. That makes it a lot easier. Okay, so we need to do because these are going to have to fold. So they have to be. So going to have to be a gap of about that far. They could probably lay it on top of each other and just. Yeah. And then just put it around like this. And then more like that. Well, hold on, hold on one second. Let's just go down the whole thing. Hold these together. And put them and just go. Cut that off right there. We'll clean it up later. Okay. Now, so that. Now we 
think can spray that with glue. And I'll just flip it. Yeah. Or just spray. Just, just what's that? Yeah, I guess. We'll spray, spray this first. Yeah. Uh, It'll count. How we done it. So those should come together like that. They'll fold up like this. We're gonna put the other one on here so it'll fold this way. So we'll have three three panels together. And we may add one more onto it just depending on how it comes out. So we'll keep you updated on that. Alright guys, so we got this put together. We got these four panels here. So this one folds this way. And we'll fold this way. And this way. So and then we'll get a strap. We're gonna get a strap to go around this to hold it all together. So then when you get where you're going, and you're ready to set up, you just set this down. like that instead of having to put all those together and then we're gonna build another one we'll build another one to go over on this side just like it and I think this end at least for now we're just gonna leave it open and we'll drill our holes down here and we'll see how that works and then when we're camping we can set our cots and stuff up over here on the floor all right guys so we're almost done with the second set of panels we just got to put the last one on here but we decided to put this fabric on the seams where these come together too just to keep it give it a little extra strength there so hopefully that will keep them from coming apart i don't think they will anyway that glue is pretty strong and i don't see it uh, really coming apart but we're going to put that on there just as an extra measure of caution so anyway we're just about done we're just wrapping up here Alright, so this is the underside of it once it's finished. 
we got to flip the other one over and put these pieces in between I don't think that's a necessity but I think it will help to keep it together a little longer and a little better so we're gonna let these dry and uh, looks like it's gonna work out real good once it's uh, done and we have it laid out I'll bring you back and show you what it looks like so I'll show you we'll show you real quick how this folds so it folds there and there and then back this way so I think it's gonna be pretty slick yeah. all right guys so this is the finished product it came together pretty good we used uh, approximately two and a half cans of this 3m 77 gluing all the edges on gluing all the fabric underneath but it seems to fold up really good we're gonna leave it in here with the heater on for a few hours and let it get good and dry um, but I think it's gonna work we left this end down here without any tiles but we left it so we could add more to it if we decide we want to do that if we done like two more it would cover the entire floor but I don't know that we want to do that um, I think we'll just leave that end open to fish in and that kind of stuff but we'll see as time goes we may decide to do that and then just cut some holes in it to fish through but uh, we'll use this end as kind of our sleeping quarters so we can put a cot here and a cot here and uh, sleep in here and uh, if you like what you see though oh before I do that so we use three cans of this we use the landscaper fabric and make sure that you get yourself some gloves because this stuff gets on your hands and it is not coming off okay without something pretty pretty strong to get it, it off some goo gone or something like that would probably do it but I got some on my hands here and it's pretty sticky but anyway if you like what you see give us a thumbs up and a like and uh, we'll give you an update on this floor as time goes on and let you know how it's working so thanks for watching.